Well, it happens tonight at 8 p.m., Sean, on the Disney Channel. Upside Down Magic. It's a premiere of a new movie. And guess who we have joining us right now to tell us all about it? The executive producer, Suzanne Farwell, joining us now. Hey. This is such a cool flick, and it's perfect if you've been stuck at the house, you want to watch something with the kids. What a great uh, movie to watch. Let's talk. Suzanne, how you doing, first of all? I'm doing great. Thanks for having me. All right, so let's talk about yeah. this. We need we need some magic in our yeah. lives. We've been stuck. I literally, I believe I have a divot inside this couch that has uh, grown <laughs> deeper and deeper over the past month. Not uh, a lot of magic going on. Right yeah, there's not a lot of magic not. going on here. But the screen behind me, we're going to start watching tonight. Upside Down Magic. Tell us about this flick. We're going to bring the magic to everyone in their homes and the comfort of their homes. Um, so Upside Down Magic is based on a best-selling uh, children's book series. And um, it's the the movie follows the best friends, Nori, played by Isabella Rose, newcomer, uh, incredible young actress, and Sienna Agudong, uh, who plays Raina, her best friend. And it's about there as they embark on their... Uh, on their journey together at Sage Academy. So they go off to what's essentially a magic boarding school. And um, it's sort of the story of their own, their, their own individual journeys, but it's also the story of their friendship. And I wanna give a special shout out. I got to watch the movie last night to the performance of Isabella Rose, the main gal who you mentioned. Um, she was so natural. It always blows my mind when a young person could be on camera and be so natural. Um, I thought her uh, best friend did a great job in the movie as well. Um, and a few Me other too. cast members that I thought were just so amazing. Um, Vicki Lewis, um, she's a big star from Broadway, but she played the headmaster of the magic yeah. school. Yes, Professor Nightslinger. <laughs> she's That's incredible. Right. Incredible. She was excellent. And Kyle, Kyle, and Howard. Kyle Howard, yeah, as 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 Professor okay. Scriff, the upside down magic, um, uh, the UDN teacher. Um, yeah, the cast across the board. I'm just so excited about um, just how great the cast is across the board. And Isabella, um, it was her first her first role, and so it was really amazing. And I just love how much you root for Nori and root for Nori and Reina's friendship. It, it, you know, it's so nice to be able to have something because you know it's going to be good for the family. You know we're going to, the kids are going to see this and be entranced by it and maybe learn something, take something positive out of it. It's going to be on the Disney Channel, of course, so you'd expect that. Yeah. Uh, tell us, uh, you know, how you know how you went into production and, and you're reading the script and, and saying, you know what, this is going to be a, a, great, a, a great movie and a positive thing for kids to watch and experience. Yeah. Well, you know, my company I have with two partners, um, Resonate Entertainment, our our focus and sort of the barometer for what we want to produce and bring into the world and, and create is um, films sort of focused on the female audience, but also um, films that are diverse and inclusive. And um, I loved the um, the girl power message of the movie and uh, in the script and their their friendship. I also love that it celebrates our differences. And um, I think the themes of, you know, celebrating our differences and what makes us different makes us special and makes us powerful are really powerful messages. So um, those are the things that drew me to the script. And I, you know, I always say you spend so much time making a movie from developing the script, production, post. It's it's a it's a long time out of your life. And so for me, I have to be very passionate about it in order to commit. Okay. And I was I, I felt yeah. that way about this. Yeah. I have to say I really appreciated the themes. It was really an uplifting film to watch. Um, and we should talk a little bit about your background. You mentioned you have a production company. Um, I know that mm -hmm. you were very experienced in films. You're, you worked on The Parent. Um, Something's Gotta Give you worked on. And also um, The Holiday, yeah. many people know, of mm -hmm. course. I mean, these are huge, amazing films. This is part of your resume. But at a certain point, uh, you decided, hey, it's time for me to go out on my own. Yeah, I did. After The Intern, um, which was the last movie that I produced uh, with Nancy Myers, um, it was just sort of time, you know, to, I had learned so much from Nancy and I was very proud to be part of bringing those movies to the world. Again, comforting movies that make people happy and that I feel have a hopeful, um, that's how I want to feel when I watch a movie. I, at the end, I want to walk out feeling uh, hopeful and positive and, and um, 
so yeah, so I so we I joined forces with Susan Cartsonis, who's my business partner uh, and also executive producer on Upside Down Magic, although I was the lead producer on set, and Brent Emery, my other partner. But yeah, we we started resonate to sort of produce these movies that we feel the female audience is an underserved audience, and we want to bring more movies to um, to that audience. So that's that was part of the mission, and Upside Down Magic fits very much into that. That's fantastic. And it's worth noting, by the way, you, you filmed this uh, filming wrapped in September last year and you've been doing post-production on Skype. <laughs> I've been doing, it was the strangest experience because normally I would have flown back up. I'm in Los Angeles now and I would have flown back to Vancouver, which any excuse to go back to Vancouver, I'll take. Of course, but, um, I, you know, I was, it's, it was normally you're on the sound mixing stage together and there's all these elements of post scoring the movie and things that, um, listen, we got it done. We get to bring the movie to everyone tonight. Um, but and so we finished it so i'm proud of that but we there really was something missing with um just the the human interaction and the camaraderie that you feel when you're all in all in a room together so i did my laundry yeah that's what i did during COVID. so i mean uh you're, you've gotten a lot more accomplished than we did he uh, did congratulations i'm We're feeling pretty to... productive <laughs> as you should uh tonight disney channel 8 p.m is gonna be a lot of fun it's great having you suzanne congratulations thank on everything. you suzanne Thanks so much for having me, guys. Bye. All right. Upside Down Magic, Bye. Disney Channel tonight uh, at 8 p.m. Plus, uh, starting tomorrow, you can download the Upside Down Magic uh, to your Disney out Now app. You can watch it anytime. You can give it to your kid if he's screaming in the back. Be like, here, just watch this. We'll be there soon. <laughs> It'll, be It'll like buy magic. you a, a, a definite, like, you know, hour and a half that, you, yeah. that you'll, they'll, uh, hopefully they'll be, I think they'll, I think they'll, They'll enjoy it, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, there's no doubt about it. Congratulations again.